boys. We hit the jackpot this time. Yo, 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 yo. What's up, YouTube? I'm back with another banger with y'all. I appreciate y'all for hitting the hitting the like button. Um, if not, if you if you first time on this page, go to the subscribe button, like, comment, feel free to voice voice your opinion. I'm looking ahead for the things like that. Thank you. Um, I just came up with an idea, man, and uh, this is the idea that I want to share to the world or anybody that's NFL fans. And this is a rivalry that's been going on for the past about three or four years now with these two young quarterbacks and. And the two teams are Kansas City Chiefs and the Baltimore Ravens. And I actually have a question with this. Will the Baltimore Ravens ever get over the hump? And what I mean by the hump, will they ever defeat the Kansas City Chiefs? Because it feel like every time when we play the Kansas City Chiefs, this is important, it feel like we, we always come close. We always come close, but it just feel like something always holds us back. Is it because Kansas City has a better team? Do they have better... Offensive oriented. Well, I'll be honest with you, I got I got to tip my head off to him. You gotta get credit when it's due. So when we when we face a team like that, that gives us a lot um a lot of time and during the off season we'll see we can improve on to you know this would be as good as those guys. So only way we can be better than them. So only way we can be better than them. We have to be good as them first. And once we get over that hump, we can just we can uh finally you know get better and uh try to achieve for more, man. Um. We can definitely surprise the Kansas City with Kansas City with a lot of plays. Um, I don't know if you checked the beginning of the video. We we played them in week two, so that's going to be a early warm up game for us for the start of regular season. A nice a head start for us to see where we at. But um, I think we can do something different. I believe in the Ravens. Um, it's never been a walk in the park. I can say that for sure. It's never been a walk in the park where the Ravens had to just buy it out and just take a blow. No, we actually fought back, but um. We just gotta do better. Um, I'm hoping that we can just turn things around. Um, you know, keep keep giving the pressure. You know, keep giving that Kansas City that that defense of pressure because in the Super Bowl we know what happened. So we ain't gonna talk about that. That's another topic for another day. But back to what I was saying on this topic with the Ravens and the uh, Kansas City Chiefs. This is a good question. Um, this is a team that we have to really look out for because Kansas City is very very dangerous. So um, they are the top. They are a top AFC team. In the in the AFC, I gotta get credit with this dude. I love my Ravens though, and we up there with them too. But I definitely think we can do something, man. Um, we just gotta come up with different game plan, different strategies. Um, you, you can definitely uh, Lamar can do his thing, you know, as far as running, you know, do some trick plays to kind of catch Kansas City de defense off guard. So we just gotta get out. We just gotta lace our shoes up and um, you know, get ready for these guys for week two. So we we have like a a little bit of time for the regular season start. I'm just giving our ideas, you know, with the world thing, because this is this the rivalry that's actually been building up for the past couple of years. So I think um, this this rivalry will always continue um, until these two legends retire. And uh, it's a great one. I mean, it's just as big as Pittsburgh and any every any rivalry we had in the Ravens history. So um, that's my intake on this video. This video is not going to be too long. I know it's a 4th of July weekend. I'm not going to hold you guys up. So, yeah, that's just my intake on Will the Ravens ever defeat the Kansas City Chiefs? And I think they will. We just got to at least not sneak no games and just, you know, keep playing hard. Give the, give the same energy they give they give us. So that's it, man. All all tick for tack. But I'm out of here, folks. You folks have a blessed one. Um, have a great weekend. And um, feel free to like. Go hit that like button, subscribe, comment. And um, I'm out, folks. Have a blessed one. Peace.